Smart contracts can now be run on the mainnet. This ushers in a new era of development on Cardano. And over the coming weeks and months, we'll see future tools and capabilities come online as the platform and user experience continues to grow and evolve. And among the most exciting of these developments to look forward to is Hydra, a key layer two solution to improve Cardano's scalability by overlaying a new protocol on top of its existing layer one blockchain. We'll be sharing more details about this at the Cardano Summit, but here's a preview of what's coming up. In a blockchain network, a consensus algorithm creates a secure and trustless environment. The challenge for any permissionless blockchain is the ability to scale and achieve any kind of throughput required to support applications in the real world, including payment, identification, gaming, and mobile services. Although Cardano can and will change fees to balance user costs, stake pool operator rewards, and network security, they will never be low enough for many real world use cases like micropayments. Storage is also a concern, as an ever-growing transaction history can lead to storage problems. Effectively, the most successful blockchains risk becoming victims of their own success. And this is where Hydra comes in. Hydra is a layer two scalability solution that seeks to address these concerns by providing more efficient means of processing transactions off-chain for a set of users while using the main chain as a secure settlement layer. Hydra keeps the security guarantees while remaining loosely coupled to the main chain. Hydra maximizes throughput, minimizes latency, incurring low to no costs, and greatly reduces storage requirements. Hydra introduces the concept of isomorphic state channels. This is to say it reuses the same ledger representation to yield uniform off-chain ledger siblings, which we call heads. Specifically for Cardano, this means that native assets, NFTs, and Plutus scripting are available inside of each Hydra head. Many of the transactions currently being handled by the main chain or applications running on the main chain can benefit directly from Hydra because it understands the same transaction format and signatures. This greatly lowers the barrier to entry to Hydra for existing and potential new customers who can reuse Cardano's tried and tested infrastructure to build wallets and applications interacting with the Layer 2 system. So where is Hydra? Right now, we've already implemented the basic Hydra head protocol as proof of concept and a developer preview will be ready at the time of the upcoming Cardano Summit. This will enable developers or anyone that's interested to run one or more Hydra nodes online, opening up a Hydra head with a limited number of participants and feeding transactions to it. However, there will likely not be any user facing components like wallets or interfaces just yet. Hydra replicates the main chain's functionality while minimizing friction for users but still allows the flexibility of having different fee cost structures and timing constraints on layer two. Any successful ecosystem balances the needs of all users and bakes in scalability and the ability to evolve from the get-go. We want this ecosystem to serve the needs of individual customers, enterprises, professionals, and the growing list of dApps and their developers. At the Cardano Summit, we will be talking more about Hydra, its progress to date, and the goals for the future. If you haven't already, be sure to register. You don't want to miss it.